What is up everybody, Everyday Cache here and welcome to a vlog. In fact, a travel vlog on a trip that I took earlier this year to Asheville, North Carolina. Y'all, for years I have been traveling with my mother and her company. They have hosted so many staff retreats over the years and have always opened the invitation to their closest loved ones or spouses. So I enjoy these opportunities to go learn a bunch about the work that they're doing, but also just to enjoy some of the luxuries of their travel while they are meeting. I get to do my own thing. So on this trip, I got to get quite a bit of work done, but also got to enjoy some amazing foods and wines in an environment that I otherwise may not have seen. Both our tummies. <laughs> no, let's get it. This day was so fun. It's been years, I'm talking probably almost decades since I have been to the Biltmore Estate. And this gave my mom and I an opportunity to bond and experience the Biltmore again with her colleagues. This is us standing in line, y'all. It was so cold out there, but we weren't out there for long. And then we got in, got acclimated and did the audio tour for a little bit. Saw these amazing views from the Biltmore Estate. If you've ever been to North Carolina, and gone to the mountains, then you are probably familiar with this huge mansion of a home that is pretty historic for our state. So we just enjoyed ourselves at the Biltmore. And then as we were leaving, we realized it was snowing. So it just started snowing. <laughs> no, you're good. Just keep freezing. <laughs> what were you thinking? What are shorts? What's up? <laughs> He said it went cold. My, my legs are, not my upper body. Ah. We went to see the Leonardo da Vinci exhibit and after that we just ended the night with a dinner from the downstairs bar at the Grand Bohemian which is where we stayed during our time in Asheville. The next day was a free day so my mom and I decided to journey over to the outlets to see what they had and I forewarned my mom that there may not be a lot out here but just take a look at what we were able to find. Perfect. 
perfect. You think you want to do it? Yeah. Okay. We're going to get in and try it. Okay. <laughs> Look, who was saying something about tacos in it? No, Tammy. Tammy went to Taco it. Billy. Is it a line? Billy Out or the Taco door. Bell? Taco Billy. Ooh. Around in the village. Oh, cool. I just think we got a five duck taco shop. Yeah, we're gonna try some tacos. Where is this? Um, good question. Um, anyway, we can get some napkins. It looks like that one. Thank you. Thank you so much. Um, that's a good meal nap. <laughs> Do I have time to take one before dinner? Mm -hmm. I hope it's more like <laughs> seven than six. Mm -hmm, me too. Oh, Lord. <laughs> You know, I don't like your, no your mouth on fire. Mm -hmm, but I like the edges. <laughs> <laughs> Not bad, better than I thought. A frozen cheer wine. I got mine with booze. Barb got hers without, so hers is a little more frozen, but it is good. I actually might finesse and get one to go. <laughs> spicy chicken taco. Oh my God. It's got spicy. I don't think you can see it. A spicy chicken tender in here this one looks like it's got bacon on it too or was that just for my other one did yours have bacon mm -hmm. hmm. but there's a little spicy chicken um looks like some kind of sauce pico oh blue cheese oh okay. mm -hmm. pico and lettuce so looks good we bust them down these tacos aren't bad <laughs> but if you don't enjoy dining with four-legged friends <laughs> Prepare to eat in your car because they out here. Dogs, cats. And we're close to the river, which is pretty cool, but mm -hmm. they've got cornhole out here. People are like, you know, this is a place where people come to eat, but more so to hang out. And they have, because they have liquors, like. And beer. Yeah. And beer. beer. Yep. Yeah, here's the beer bus behind us. Here's the beer bus. And this is what it looks like. And there's the river over there. Cool little spot, I'll admit. And I think they have more than one location, but Barb and I were just, we were tired after going out to um, shop. So if that's what we're going to call it. <laughs> I tried to warn Barb, y'all, that our folks over in Asheville, no shade, but on the western side of the uh, state, when it comes to style, I think the urban and city folks got y'all beat. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. So, coming out to shop was a little, um, I think, a little different than what Barb anticipated. She wasn't able to really find the fashions. But. Car was gonna sound like. I'm so glad because your earrings look nice. Thank yeah. you. That's what it is. I said it like that. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, what was he expecting? Yeah, like, like that anything, was a limit. Really? No. Come on, did I hit something? What? So like, after yeah. enjoying our tacos, we returned back to our hotel, just to Wusa, and later on, we got up to head out to dinner with a couple of my mom's colleagues. Here's what I wore. You tired? Okay, well then go. <laughs> Starting from the top, I've got on a Carhartt toboggan that's linked on my Amazon storefront. I also have on this white basic hoodie that is also linked on my storefront with an old bag grabbed from Shein, a pair of Fashion Nova jeans that I absolutely love. They are linked in the description box below and my Air Jordan 1 Retro LA to Chicago's. Absolutely love these. And this is just Barb and I jamming out for a little bit while headed over to Baby Bull. Oh, it looks like it's a little bit of a 
lightweight, but it's also decently warm. We grabbed us some great food, even better drinks. Enjoyed our time again with my mom's colleagues, headed back to the hotel, and we all just decided to grab a little nightcap, have a drink, and just chill out. So that's what we did. And that ends our trip to Asheville, North Carolina. Earlier this year, in February 2023, I had a phenomenal time, y'all, and would definitely recommend if you haven't been.